talking Bloody Marys, right? Everybody kind of has the thing they like in their Bloody Mary, but you guys have blocked. Are you serious? All this goes into My a Bloody goodness. Mary? Yep. What have you brought? Tell us about all of this. So uh, some of the items are just kind of standard Bloody Mary um, toppings, like olives, mm -hmm. lemons, limes. Um, we kind of got a little creative. We wanted to incorporate some of the things that were on our Beatrix menu. So we added our Kung Pao Brussels sprouts. We also have our brown sugar bacon. Um, we feature um, some different local tomato juices, different rimmers for the guests to choose from, as well rimmers. as uh, different spirits. Okay, so, but, okay, so I see all of this. And a lot in the South, I've seen, we were talking about this, Mark, mm -hmm. a lot of Bloody Marys that have, like, Watermelons on top, and they've got watermelons. They've got like yeah. uh, burgers. They've got rib. It's like a Fred Flintstone thing where the thing just wants to zip over. Okay, but what's the key to making the perfect Bloody Mary? I think you have to have a lot of balance. Uh, a great, great quality vodka and a uh, mm -hmm. great Bloody Mary mix is a good, good mm -hmm. way to start. Okay, show us. Where do we begin? Right, what are we coming up with here? What All do right. we got? We got some. I uh, got a nice uh, vodka here. So right. vodka. We'll do a little bit of this. Okay, so you're pouring in the All vodka right. here. And Start it, with vodka. Yeah, and is, vodka. do you have a yeah. particular vodka that mm -hmm. you like? I mean, is, does it matter? In the restaurant, we use Grey Goose Citroen. We also have a uh, rehorsed uh, Great Lakes vodka, uh, okay. which is a local option mm -hmm. for okay. us. Okay, I'm, I'm thinking once you put all the different things in there, maybe the vodka um, flavor is <laughs> as important, right? <laughs> it's not as important, but it's got the lemon citrus flavor to it, so okay. it has a nice little so punch. So that adds a nice. Okay, right. and then so what, so what are you doing over here? So just adding a little bit of ice. Mm -hmm. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and put a rimmer on this. Put around here. Sure, you got to put a rim around. So right? you know what I mean. And what do you got here? Now we've got all kinds that looks like. <laughs> we've got Spices a barbecue spice, and, uh -huh. we've got celery salt, and we've got a uh, pepper bacon spice. Okay, mm -hmm. so you pick one or you do a mix? Okay. Yeah, I usually pick one. Yeah, okay. This one has a little bit of celery salt. Okay, and so what? And then we're just going to go ahead and take this and All right. just roll it over. And mix that up, huh? Just like such. Mm -hmm. yeah. I like the little twisty thing you do there. Yeah. A little, little yeah, flair okay. to it. Yeah? Let, me, let me see what you're going to do with this. Show me what you would you know do what? with all you know this. Let's just taste it. it. How about that? Let's, okay. get right to the, let's get right to the I business end here. But while he's tasting it, grab that one and show mm. me how you would top some of these other ones because some sure. of this stuff in here is crazy. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. So right. what would you so what cool. would you do? What so would you personally do? What I would do is I'd yeah. come around the front side. Okay, come around here, okay? Come, around. come on around. This is what our guests mm -hmm. do. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'd grab a uh, skewer of pepper jack cheese. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Got a nice little kick to it. Sure. Okay. I'd put a little dollop of roasted garlic. Oh, mm -hmm. so you literally have a Bloody Mary bar that people can help themselves? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is, okay. this is buffet style, yeah. Oh, we have okay. in the back of our restaurant, we've got a, uh, a second bar, and we were trying uh -huh. to figure out, you know, something unique and fun that we could do with it. Okay. Um, and uh, we decided that a Bloody Mary bar would be the way to go. I love so it. everybody should have a second bar. Right? <laughs> right. A Bloody Mary. Okay, now what's up with the Brussels sprouts? Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> so the Brussels sprouts are a great, a great menu item. Is that um, what this is here? Yeah. Uh -huh. Kung Pao Brussels sprouts. And you, do you put, that in, you put that in the Bloody Mary? Okay, I'm poking. You can, absolutely. Poking okay, and then this, how about, the, tell Russell me a story sprouts. about the bacon. So the brown sugar bacon is a, is a staple oh. Beatrix item for us. It's probably oh. our, it's a highlight of our breakfast menu. It's a little special. Mm -hmm. um, okay. And we've been featuring that on our menu for about four years now and it's something mm. that our guests go crazy for. And who doesn't want bacon in their Bloody Mary? Oh so gosh. we thought it'd be a nice, a nice okay. fit. Mark, I gotta give you, you a piece of this bacon. You could try the Brussels sprouts. No, 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 you need to try oh. the bacon. Okay, Brussels sprouts wrapped I'm in bacon. To get you. How's there that? you go. I think that's going to be the way to go here. <laughs> Look at this. This is like a side of a pig Very here. fun. So this is really, right. this is really a, a kind of gets interactive Look and it's this. great for the guests to come okay, in and just get involved, right? Yep. Healthy and delicious. Okay, what's the craziest thing you've ever seen put in a Bloody Mary? Mm -mm. At our restaurant? Uh huh. What do you think? Mm. I'd say we get people that just keep coming back for more. <laughs> the people that will just load multiple pieces of bacon, multiple Brussels sprouts. We also do our mm. potato salad deviled eggs that aren't here right now. But um, when you get the guest that just fills it up as high as possible, mm -hmm. that's always uh, that's always fun to watch. Mm -hmm. Have you been to Beatrix? I'm going now. I was going to say, I've been. <laughs> Excellent restaurant. Thanks. You, you got, hey, by the way, you do anything special for Restaurant Week? We are, this is special for Restaurant Week. This of is course. our first year featuring brunch for Restaurant Week. So we wanted to tie it in with the Bloody Mary okay. bar. So anyone that comes in uh, and wants to participate in Restaurant Week for brunch um, has the option of an entree and then they get to choose if they'd like to do either a, a specialty coffee and a pastry mm -hmm. uh, from our pastry counter or uh, one visit to the Bloody Mary bar how, with all the toppings. How much? Uh, it's $22. Okay, $22. Mm -hmm. well, this is brunch, this is food, this is drink, this is everything. It's like a meal and uh, a drink in one. Okay, what's your website, by the way? Mm -hmm. Website is BeatrixChicago.com, and you can choose between the River North location, the Streeterville location, and eventually uh, a Fulton Market West Loop location. Very, very nice. Thanks for coming in, guys. That was fun. Thank you so much for having me.